Okay, so one of the members asked the question that uh, what is the difference between acute and chronic liver failure and decompensated liver failure? I forgot the name of the member who asked, but I remembered the comment. So understand that in both ACLF means acute and chronic liver failure and decompensated liver failure, there is a pre-existing liver disease. The patient is having liver disease because of the cirrhosis, could be any condition, could be any cause like diabetes, ethanol or anything. Now in acute and chronic liver failure, what happens that because of an acute insult, whether it could be an infection, whether it could be a surgery, whether it could be a trauma or anything, the patient uh, liver function deteriorate and that's why because of an acute insult, the liver det uh, deteriorates. So we call it acute and chronic liver failure. While a decompensated liver failure means the organ involved is the liver, it's a cirrhotic liver and because of this, as a gradual progression, uh, the patient can develop hepati uh, hepatic encephalopathy or um, uh, upper GI bleed or ascites like that. The difference is acute and chronic liver failure has a high short term mortality while decompensated liver failure follows a slower course. So thank you for asking and do read more about it.